which is it? Headed west into Mississippi, uh, right around Gulfport, Biloxi area. I am en route to go link up with Miss Carol, Mr. Rick of Kids Outdoors, and we're gonna go film another special young man and uh, Mr. Payton and have a great time as he gets to go after a red stag. Yes, a red stag. How cool is that? So what we got going on today, guys? What are we doing? Red stag hunt. Yeah? Perfect. Are you excited? Very excited. Cool. Have you done anything like this before? No, sir. No? Oh, oh man. Only whitetail. White, white only whitetail? White white really? Sir. Man, you're working your way up. So now you got your whitetail, you get you a red stag, and you get, well, I guess uh, an elk, and then we'll go caribou and moose, huh? <laughs> Just work your way up to the big ones, right? Awesome. Sure. Alrighty. Alright, we'll get it done today, alright? Sure. Okay, let's do this. <laughs> okay. So nice. this already got the air in it now. Yeah. This is this is the chamber right here. It's got we're sitting on 22, 2400 pounds pressure right now. Oh, this, this is the safety right here. That oh, goes, goes forward. forward. And one of us can help you or you can do it or whoever, but it's, yeah, uh, it's I'll, simple I'll, to do that. But as long as we're doing this, we're not gonna step in front of it. Okay, now, go ahead and get comfortable one more time and let's make sure, let me loosen you in. Safety? It's not loud, loud. All right, you good? And it doesn't kick. I'm taking the safety off, okay? Fire in the hole. Can you tighten it up just a little bit? Yeah. Kind of Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And now, what are we gonna do? That's right. We put one down. So we got courtesy of Nichols Outfitters in Pelham. Thanks for the airbow the use. Kids outdoors. We got a tag along here. I don't know who are you. Where did you come from? Oh, are you? Oh, you're the one. You're, you're gonna bring it. You're gonna tape it out. Skin it. Process it. Cook it. I heard you dragging it. What? You're the you're the muscle, right? Actually, he's the one that got fighting his blood when he had his, his uh, stem cell transplant. Oh, awesome. There you go, huh? Literally blood. Huh? Awesome. But that's not by speculation. But the position that I got. exotic hunting we, we wasn't sure what to expect uh, we knew Miss Carol would come through her and Mr. Rick at Kids Outdoors you know before we met them we just went out of the hood in, in the woods and, 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 and sat and since we've like I said we went from hunting struggles to hunting stories and uh, you know this is just another example of that you know uh, 
it's different for Peyton what it takes to get him in the woods and, and what you got to do. And they do a great job of, of making sure that whatever works for Peyton is what we do. And, uh, you know, that makes a huge difference. It's, it's one thing for me to do it as his dad, you know, but I'm limited. But, you know, when they call, you know, they say, tell us what we need to do. And, and it's, it's, it's made a huge difference as, as far as just the success of, of his time in the outdoors as a whole. What you can't see about Peyton, this right here is about three layers of bandages. You know, he's, we're out here in, in our pants. It, he's, he's basically out here in thermals and coveralls. It's, it's truly life changing. I mean, what, what we have been able to do, you know, since we met them is, you know, a everybody needs to see you know what, what good it is it, it's, it's just so much fun not, not only the hunts that we go on but the times that we spend talking about it before and after is it, just uh, you know priceless you, you can't you, you can't buy this kind of stuff it's uh it, it's not every day that you meet somebody that says hey you tell us what works for you and we'll work it out and that's what kids like him need uh you know when we go to a hospital, they give us the rules, or we go here, they give us the rules. When we talk to Miss Carol and then they say, look, you tell us, you know, how to facilitate what we're trying to do. And, and it changes everything, you know, it, it really does make the, make the challenges bearable. Yeah. Well, I usually go into hunts expecting to, you don't get to kill the biggest one out there, but he was one of the biggest ones that I wasn't, I wasn't expecting to get to kill one of those. All right, so you weren't lying. You said it's time to get it done. You got it done, didn't you? Sir. Sure. Yep. So, man, out here in Mississippi, it's August. It's hot, right? How are you feeling other than being hot? Great. Yeah. Yeah. So, kids outdoors, they brought you here, took care of everything. Where'd you come from? Where are you from? Or let, uh, I'll tell you what, let's tell everybody who you are and where you're from. Uh, my name's Peyton Jordan. I'm 17 years old, and I'm from Jacksonville, Alabama. Jacksonville, Alabama. No roll tie. Oh yeah. Oh okay. All right, there we go. <laughs> so how long you been hunting? Uh, this is my second year. This oh. is my first year with kids outdoors. Okay. And you got a white tail before. Got a and white tail and two hogs. And two hogs. That's right. Your dad was telling me about it. And then today you got the red stag. Right. So like we were talking earlier, I think what he's doing, he's trying to milk the system and getting the the white tails and then working his way up to the red stag. So I'm hoping that you'll invite me back when we go after it now. Oh, yeah. Oh, there we go. Done deal, folks. So, all right. Congratulations Thank again. You. And uh, I think now the work really begins, right? We're talking about getting the hide off. And the but then the fun part is we get to have some stuff. Right? Yeah. That's right. That's right. All right, folks. Hey, you're going to check it out. Mississippi. Uh, thank you to Doc. Thank you to Kids Outdoors, Ms. Carol, Mr. Rick, for inviting Master Suit TV. On behalf of them and Wilbur and Keith, uh, continue to watch uh, Master Street TV on Pursuit Channel, but also more importantly, check out kidsoutdoors.org. Kids with a Z, outdoors with an S. All right, check them out, YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, and like always, you'll see them plastered on our website and social media. The wonderful things that they do, continue to do, and only through generous support, uh, through financial donations, landowners, um, just, you know, coming out and making a peanut butter and jelly sandwich and saying hi to kids. That's as simple as that. So y'all take care. Thanks for watching. And like always, work hard, I'm harder.